We have fresh venison courtesy of this afternoon's whitetail harvest. Have the Outdoor Edge game processor and the boning fillet knife. I have a piece of back strap here. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put my knife underneath and just get the bottom piece of the uh, silver skin. This is sort of like filleting a fish. I'm gonna press down with the knife while holding the edge of the silver skin and then I'll pull the entire tenderloin towards me. There we go. And it's not perfect, but the seal's able to get a good portion of that silver skin off the back strap. Then I can just go ahead and peel the rest of that off. Let's cut up some steaks with the Outdoor Edge butcher knife. Since this back strap is so narrow, I'm gonna make wide cuts, and then we're gonna butterfly them. I'm just gonna cut down about 70 or 80% of the way through the steak, and then you just fold them open like that. Bam, and you have a nice little steak. We'll do another one here. And I'll season them up on both sides with High Mountain Seasonings Deer Steak Seasoning. Meanwhile, I'm gonna drop some fresh Colorado russet potatoes in the boiling water. Pull the potatoes off the stove and we'll strain those. Pour a little bit of milk in the potatoes. And I'm just gonna use some of the things that we had already at the house. With creative cooking, it's a lot of fun. I found a little bit of sour cream in the refrigerator. So there goes the sour cream. Have just a little bit of cream cheese left over. We're gonna put that in there. And High Mountains Hickory Burger Seasoning. You've seen me use this a lot of times. It's my secret weapon. I'm gonna put a good amount of that in the potatoes. Pan mixer. You could add cheese in there. We don't have any cheese right now, but we did have some turkey bacon in the freezer, so I have probably nine or 10 strips of turkey bacon that I microwaved. For about three minutes, we're gonna put that in there. It's a snowy day outside, and I don't feel like getting cold, so we're just gonna use the George Foreman. Of course, the deer back straps with the high mountain seasoning. Couple cans of cream corn heated in the microwave. You already know how to do that. We'll call the family up to dinner. Delicious mashed potatoes with turkey bacon, high mountains, hickory burger seasoning, cream cheese, sour cream and milk, cream corn, and deer steaks from the roadkill today. Thanks for joining me today. If you haven't subscribed to our videos, please do so. And until next time, this is the Rocky Mountain Meat Hunter saying praise the Lord and pass the venison.